Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. I hope you all are having an awesome day. So let's get started with music class. Today, we are going to do a really fun activity using steady beat. What are we going to be doing? Steady, steady beat. beat. Steady beat. So we're going to be using engine engine number nine. What is it called? Engine engine number nine. Wow, y'all are really good listeners. Awesome. Okay, so here's the deal. I am going to say this whole entire thing for you by myself. You ready to listen? Here I go. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? And now we're going to learn it together. So here's what I want to do. I'm going to say just that very first line by myself, and then you will repeat it after me. Can we do that? Yes. Me first. Engine, engine number nine. Engine, engine number nine. Awesome. Next, me first. Going down Chicago line. Going down Chicago line. Wow, you all sound great. Now guess what? I'm going to put these two together by myself first. I'm going to say both, then you will repeat both. Okay, so wait till I'm done. Here I go. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. That was great. Here I go again. Next line. If the train falls off the track. If the train falls off the track. Will I get my money back? Will I get my money back? Can you show me your money? Money, money, money. Cool. Okay. Now guess what? I'm going to say both of these together by myself. And then you will say both. Here I go. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Great. Now, the hardest part yet. We have to try and say the whole entire thing. Yikes. Okay. Do me a favor. We're going to say this whole thing together. On the last line, I want you to show me your what? My money. Show me your money. You can't see. They Ready? Can't see and here we go. Engine, engine number nine. Going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Great job. This time as we say it, we are going to keep that steady beat together. Do you see how I have a heart over some words? Mm -hmm. Can somebody raise your hand and tell me, what do you think the heart represents? The steady what? The steady beat. That is correct. The heart represents the steady beat. So we're going to start with patting our legs. Can you put your hands on your lap just like me? You're going to pat every time you see that heart. We're going to follow it along. Are you ready? It's that steady beat. Let's speak and pat, and here we go. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? That was fantastic. Okay, next, we're gonna do the exact same thing, but with stomping. So you get a choice. You can do both feet at the same time, or you can alternate. I have to alternate because I'm standing, okay? You ready for this? Stomping and speaking. And here we go. Engine, engine number nine. Going down Chicago. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money? Fantastic. And now we're going to clap. Are you ready? Clap loud and proud. Here we go. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Awesome. Okay, last time for steady bead, we're going to be the trains choo choo. And I need you to get your arm out just like this. And we're going to do this. 
to the steady beat. Are you ready for this? And here we go. Engine. Going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Great job. Now, what have I added? Trains. I put some trains instead of the heart. Guess what? They are in the exact same place on the steady beat, right? Mm -hmm. Um, How many trains do you see in a row? Can I get a hand up? How many trains do you see in one line? Yes. Four. Four, very good. Each line that we said had four pats or four claps or four stomps or four arms, whatever, right? So now, can you please, let's go back to Pat. I like that one. Let's go back to Pat. You're gonna pat four times in each line, which is just the same as the steady beat. You're following the trains. You ready to try? Yep. Engine, That's engine, patting. Good. Here we go. Engine, engine number nine. Going down Chicago high. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money? Fantastic. Now watch this. Whoa, what is that craziness? Now we have some different cars of the train and a big red train at the end. So guess what? Here's what we're going to talk about now. This slide is showing us the difference between beat versus rhythm. So we've done our steady beat. We know what that sounds like. We patted it. We clapped it. We stomped it. We did everything to it. We, we are perfect at our steady beat. Now I want to show you what the rhythm of engine engine looks like. So first I have a quick little saying for you to help you remember the difference. Listen to this. The beat stays the same, but the rhythm changes with the words. Here's what I did. At the beginning, the beat stays the same. We know that because of engine engine. It keeps going. It doesn't stop. It doesn't change. It's the same thing over and over. But the rhythm of this changes with every little syllable of the word. Engine, engine. Okay, it's gonna be every little thing. So listen to me say this again, and then you're gonna try after me. The beat stays the same, but the rhythm changes with the words. Do me a favor, can you take out one flat hand and take out two fingers, and we're gonna try saying this together starting with tapping the beat, and then we're gonna change to the rhythm. Ready to try? Here we go. The beat stays the same, but the rhythm changes with the words. Cool. Now do me a favor. Don't say anything. Don't try with me. I want you to just watch. I'm going to clap the rhythm while I speak engine engine. I'm going to clap every tiny little part of the word that you hear. Here I go. This is the rhythm. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Do you see how I clapped every tiny little sound? Yeah? Do you think you can try with me? Yeah. Okay, this time, guess what? You're not gonna clap. You're gonna go back to flat hand and two fingers. Go ahead and get them out for me. And we're going to tap every tiny little thing that we hear as we speak. Follow the trains, are you ready? And here we go. Engine, engine number nine, going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money back? Great job. So now that you've tapped each part of the word, each little syllable that you heard, you are just tapping the rhythm, okay? Let's just try one more thing. We're gonna pat as we speak it, and we're going to only pat the rhythm. Are you ready? All hands on your legs. Last time, it's gonna be great, I can tell. 
And here we go. Engine, engine number nine. Going down Chicago line. If the train falls off the track, will I get my money 